Road Hard Roadhouse is sponsored by Speedy's Industrial Coatings in Ozark, Missouri. Whether you need anything big or small done, they'll take care of it at Speedy's. Make sure to turn off your power. Today on the Road Hard Roadhouse, we're going to replace a photo cell. You can see the one I've halfway taken out up there. It was not working anymore. When it's not working anymore, your lights will be on all the time. I have a shop, a light in the middle of my shop that I want just on at night. Let's fix this thing and put it on. Let's get it started. Now I went with this torque model. I could, it's easily bought at uh, Lowe's. And I was looking at this one. This is my old one. And I noticed, I noticed that it didn't have a rubber gasket like this new one does. And, you know, I'm not sure if that's part of the reason why it went out. I'm not sure how long these things last, but we'll see how long this one lasts from Lowe's. There you go. I got this one. It was uh, about $13. It's, the reason why I got it is because it's almost exactly like the other one. So I wasn't going to have to change much of anything. This end down here screws into your box. And uh, the wiring is the same. Now when you get inside, I'll show you here in a second. But this, this red one is the power. Of course, the ground, the neutral. Now I'm putting this underneath an eave right here, so it's gonna—it's not gonna get rained on unless it's raining sideways. But uh, make sure you take off this little nut here, because that nut will uh, be on the inside of the box. Now the box is right on the inside of this. I'm gonna go ahead and put it on. Now I put it on, I'm going to have to go in behind it and put on this uh, little nut. Make sure you do this. Make sure that rubber gasket's in between the two. Did I tell you all to turn off your power? Make sure you turn off your power. You don't want to get lit up. Okay, got the little nut on the back of the uh, photo cell. This red wire is gonna be your hot wire. And my hot wire is this black one down here. Then you have your neutral, which is your white. The black, go up to this ground up here. And you're done. Your power should still be turned off. Get your wire nuts reinstalled and close up the box. Okay, now you can turn back on your power. Excuse all the other extension cords and stuff. I'm in the process of wiring the shop. But uh, this light bulb right there is the one I uh, want working at night. And as soon as I turned the power back on, it was on. And in the instructions, it says that it will stay on for less than two minutes and then it'll shut itself off. Now, when it gets dark outside, yeah, it's probably about six o'clock. It'll be about an hour and a half before it gets dark that light will come on then. I guess I gotta unwrap my flag there, but here it is. I ran the cover over the lens itself and it's up underneath that eave. Should work out really good there. I'm gonna end up putting another light up front here. That's a solar light up there. I'm gonna put it on the back of my, my shop. Have a light that's on out on here from dusk till dawn. Okay, I turned the power back off and I'm going to show you this. It said that when you first turn on to make sure it's working, the light will come on in less than two minutes. It will shut itself off. I'm going to wire the front security light out to this as well because it's going to be dust till dawn. The rest of the lights will be motion detector type stuff. There 
it goes. Minute and 45 seconds. Here we go. It's working. This is after dark and it's working by itself. This is how bright my one light is in my shop that I have running during the night. So I can actually get in here and get to the, the switch to turn on the other lights. This is my whole goal in this. And I've had it running for months and months without it working. Because when a photo cell does not work anymore, it will be on all the time. So that's a way to tell if your photo cell is bad, if it's on all the time. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions regarding this Torque photo cell, let me know down in the comments down below. Thank you for watching and always subscribe, like, and comment down below. And as always, if you're right or hard, don't burn away wet. The Road Hard Roadhouse is sponsored by Speedy's Industrial Coatings in Ozark, Missouri. If you need anything powder coated, let us know.